Hello students, welcome to the next lecture on the GATE 2024 Mathematics. Today I will explain you how you can solve this question number 51 with the help of shortcut tricks. So what is the statement? You can see it is given that T and S are my non-zero okay, and they are my non-identity linear transformation such that T square is equal to T. So firstly you have to think about that whether this is my characteristics polynomial no why because you can see the degree is my 4 but it is my 2 so definitely it is not a characteristics polynomial so what is the name of this polynomial that is called as the annihilating polynomial fine if i call annihilating polynomial is x square minus x is 0 now how you can identify the characteristics polynomial or how you can check whether it's a invertible diagonal or similar you can see can you find the minimal polynomial we all know minimal polynomial will divide this annihilating polynomial. So I can factorize them. This is x minus 1 is 0. So the minimal polynomial is either x is equal to 0 or x minus 1 0 or x into x minus 1 0. Fine. So if this is 0, the corresponding matrix will be here. Corresponding matrix will be here. Corresponding value will be this one. But you can see it is given that they are non-zero and non-identity that means the minimal polynomial of the matrix t is my x into x minus 1 is it okay this is my minimal polynomial now you can see these are the two factors both the factors are my linear fine so what does it means t is my diagonal fine because we all know when whenever the minimal polynomials is obtained in the form of the linear factor then this is always diagonal so this option is identity correct option now look at the first option what is the first option it is necessary invertible t is necessary invertible is it all is it possible no because this is again the annihilating polynomial if i called t is my i fine then clearly say this value will be my zero fine so what does it means that means this value will not be is invertible so that means this number will be zero so hence this is invertible is not the correct answer is it okay now look about the other two options t and s are similar t and s are similar when you can say that two matrix are similar when when you can say the jordan block of the t and the Jordan block of the S are same corresponding to the each eigenvalue for each eigenvalue. Now, what is the characteristics equation of the S? Is it given to you? Let me firstly explain you this one. It is not given, but it is given that 0 and 1 are the eigenvalues. So, I can write the characteristics equation. Again, it is of degree 4. So, either it will be like here, fine, or it could be like of this x minus 1 cube or it could be like of x2, x3, x minus 1 and so on. Fine. This is the characteristics polynomial. Now, can you write the Jordan block corresponding to the any pair? Let's say I can write this one. What is the, uh, what is the characteristics polynomial? What is the Jordan block of this? 1 value 0, this, this and this. Fine. This is the Jordan block of the S. I ca I, you can choose any pair. If you take this one, then 3, 0 and 1. If you consider this, then the 2, 0 and the 2, 1. Now, can you define the Jordan block of the T? Again, T, this is my, this is my annihilating polynomial. So, again, the eigenvalues are my 0 and 1. Fine. So, it may be that the characteristics polynomial of T will be x cube, x minus 1. Fine. Then, in that case, your answer will be here so r do you know do you get this is the this is the jordan block corresponding to eigen value this is the jordan block corresponding to eigen value one and you can see they are not same or you can see i consider this is the one block this is the two block and this is only one block so it means the jordan block of the s is not equal to the jordan block of the t always so that means it is not always similar clear now, look at the third option, uh, second option. 
एस स्केयर इज इकल टू एस दैट मीन्स इट इज सिमिलर टू द टी स्केयर इज एस एंड अगेन एस इज माई नॉन जीरो एंड एस इज आइडेंटिक दैट मीन्स एस इज ऑल्सो डेग्जेबल फाइन नाउ वी ऑल नोस इफ टी इज माई डेग्जेबल देन कैन यू फाइंड द रैंक ऑफ द टी येस यू कैन इजली फाइंड द रैंक ऑफ टी इज द नंबर ऑफ द नॉन जीरो आइगन वैल्यूज रिमेंबर दिस रिजल्ट इज ऑनली एप्लीकेबल वेन द टी इज वेन एवर द मेट्रिक्स इज डेग्जेबल नाउ टी इज डेग्जेबल सो द रैंक ऑफ टी इज माई नंबर ऑफ द नॉन जीरो आइगन वैल्यूज रैंक ऑफ द एस अगेन एस इज माई डेग्जेबल सो इट इज अगेन द नंबर ऑफ द नॉन जीरो आइगन वैल्यूज सो वट आर द आइगन वैल्यूज ऑफ द टी जीरो एंड वन सो वन इज द ओनली नॉन जीरो आइगन वैल्यू सेम फॉर हियर नाउ डज इट अ सिमिलर अगेन यू कैन सी इफ आई राइट द जॉर्डन ब्लॉक कॉरेस्पॉन्डिंग टू द एस सपोज यू हैव दिस मैट्रिक दिस इज माई जॉर्डन जॉर्डन ब्लॉक कॉरेस्पॉन्डिंग टू एस इफ आई राइट द जॉर्डन ब्लॉक कॉरेस्पॉन्डिंग टू द टी इज माई हियर फॉर एग्जाम्पल देन इट इज नॉट ए सिमिलर बट वट इज द रैंक ऑफ द एस इट्स अ टू बट रैंक ऑफ द टी इज माई थ्री बट वी नीड अ रैंक ऑफ द टी एंड रैंक ऑफ द एस विल बी सेम वेन इट विल बी पॉसिबल only possible when this value must be zero or either this value must be one then only the three cross three will be here so that means whenever the rank are same and both are my diagonal then they are my similar as well so that means b and d are my correct answers of this problem so this is a very simple way you just think about the jordan blocks and you can get your answer If you watch, if you want to interest you to find another lectures, you can simply follow my YouTube channel. Till then, you can simply share and uh, scan and join my WhatsApp group for the various discussions. I hope you can like my videos as well. We will see the next video very soon. Best of luck, students. Happy learning.